What up, gang? Carolina Jackpot coming at you on Sunday morning. So, news has come out this morning that uh, the Taters have dismissed cornerback Darian Kendrick from the football team. Uh, been a starter for, what, three years? And was projected to possibly be like uh, a late first rounder uh, this year in the uh, draft. The thing about it is... Um, we don't really know why he got dismissed from the team by Dabo. Uh, multiple reports uh, on my anonymous side from my sources uh, say that uh, he smoked a little bit of that old, uh, that old uh, left-handed luckies, and uh, he didn't like to go to class. So, I mean, that that I think is probably you know a lot of uh, not just college football players, but people in college. In general, but I guess up at Clemson, it don't fly. The thing about it is, what he's been there for, he was a class of 2018, so he's been there for a minute. He's been there for a hot minute. Um, this is just now becoming a problem, <laughs> and you're just now keep off the team, whatever. Uh, you know, I, Dabo is, uh, if he's anything, he's not a dumbass. Um, he's going to give him enough chances to keep him around long enough and give him a long enough leash to where uh, he doesn't have to do anything until... He has, you know, replacements where it's not going to hurt him that much uh, to move in. And that's exactly what he's got. He's got Andrew Booth. Uh, so the kid, you know, a couple years ago, I posted the thing. We punched a Louisville player and got like a 15-yard penalty. He got thrown out of the game, I think. Uh, anyway, he plays cornerback. Uh, he's pretty decent. And uh, he's got some other kids coming in. So they, it, it really won't hurt them that much team-wise. But my thing about it is I, I, Clemson fan – all over Facebook and Twitter this morning talking about, well, he wasn't any good anyway. Well, he's, he he wasn't no good anyhow. He sucked. Uh, he never did. He never did. Uh, uh, he never did produce in the big moments. Uh, you know what? Shut up. Uh, just shut up. I mean, you, some of you idiots, I swear, are so damn football brain dead. You're so sucked into that stupid little cult you got over there that you don't even know what the big picture is. Dude, they wouldn't be projecting him as a late first fucking rounder if he wasn't any fucking good. Period. Point blank. Didn't make a lot of tackles last year, and he's another one of them players kind of like a J.C. Horn. Who he, they don't have eye popping tackle numbers. They don't have eye popping tackle for loss numbers. They don't have eye popping you know interception numbers because number one, uh, opposing teams really don't attack that side of the field too much because they know they're over there. And uh, number two, because uh, your guys up front, your front seven's doing their job. Uh, they're doing their job, and for the most part, the Tater front seven has done its job and done it well. You know, if your front seven's doing their job and doing it well, your defensive backs shouldn't be having to make a bunch of damn tackles. They shouldn't be having to make a bunch of tackles. Your defensive backs uh, are making a bunch of tackles. Pretty much, it means your defense sucks ass, and uh, you're probably giving up a lot of points. You're probably not winning a lot of fucking games uh, unless your offense is, like, scoring a shit ton of points. So that was the deal with that. But, uh, yeah, I just thought it was kind of funny that they're they're salty now. He's got kicked off. The, well, he's not. They're not soft. He's gets kicked off the team. They're making excuses now that we've gotten kicked off the team. That oh, he wasn't no good. He he he's wasn't no good. Carolina jackpot. What you talking about? That a boy couldn't play no football. If it damn, <laughs> I really life depended on it. Uh, I just think it's crazy. This has got to be a blow for you guys. I mean, you got your ass kicked yesterday in baseball. Are you going to get your ass kicked again today? You're not winning the Founders Park today. You're just not. Um, you're putting a freshman on the bump. Mm -mm, it's not happening. And then, you know, one of the best players on your defense booted off the team uh, for smoking too much weed and uh, not going to class. But, yeah, that's where we're at. So, um, if you're a tater, uh, you're taking your lumps. You're taking your lumps. And um, it's, I don't know. I can't say that it, that it feels good to see, but um feels good to see it. <laughs> don't make fun of my florida shirt this is not the florida gators it's not the florida marlins it's not anything really to do with any sports team in florida i just bought this thing last uh october when we were in daytona at one of them truck stops slash convenience stores uh i think somewhere near palatka and yeah, that sells the pecan rolls and the cigarettes and like they got fresh oranges there well they have t-shirts this was like six dollars so i bought it thought it was kind of cool with the script baseball design on it Anyway, uh, go Gamecocks, uh, go Coach Beamer, uh, Clemson. You know, I hope you can uh, pick up the pieces and uh, get on with your life. I'm sure you'll be fine, but uh, it's just uh, 
It's kind of entertaining, you know, to see a little bit of trouble in paradise, if you will. I'll see y'all later. Appreciate it. Peace. And I'm out. Ah, ah, ah. Go Cogs. Woo!